Hey guys, I've been super into stretching recently, so today I'm going to be taking you guys with me on my daily stretching routine. I like to start with shoulders and then work my way down. So we start pulling one arm across your body. I want it for like 10 seconds. And switch arms. This reminds me of when I was a kid and we do gymnastics warm ups, but they managed to do 100 jumping jacks at the end of every practice. So, it's not like Alright, so after those arms, we're gonna bring shoulders around, I mean, elbows. Push your elbow down to your back. Try to twist your head as low on your back as you can. And switch arms. going to flip to your butt, bring your arms behind your back, try to touch your pinkies together. You can see that. Some of my friends can do this. I cannot. My shoulder mobility is done so bad after starting Ninja. In gymnastics, I was always working on mobility and flexibility, and then after quitting, all my muscles just tighten up. Honestly, that's the extent I do for arms. Um, I like to stretch my back and my legs more. So, this is a good lazy day stretch. I like to put my one quad under and just lie down. I honestly just sit here while I scroll on my phone or I'll call someone or do anything. You can just lie here, it's comfortable, and you can feel the stretch. I honestly like this one, so I'll do it for a long because I don't want to get out of it sometimes. I wonder if I want to be my choke back. That was difficult. I really don't feel like that was worth it. Now, we're going to toe in two. You guys are definitely not going to be able to see my head. We're doing wide angle camera for this part because you can definitely not see this. But I do right leg first, right leg is a good leg. My knees are going to keep bruising them, really falling on them, and I like banged my wand into the coffee table the other day. So that was not ideal. I did my nails recently. My roommate Hannah has a like gel nail kit and she always lets us use it. She's the best, love her. Oh, I literally left a footprint on here. I definitely can't see that. All right, from here, you're gonna straighten this leg. Keep this leg the same and try to touch your nose to your knee. I can't do it, but that's all we're doing. Stretch it, so we're getting there. Lay as flat as you can. You don't want your back to be hunched over like that. It's better for your nose to be farther from your knee and your back to be flat. It's better stretch and it's just bad for you to be hunched over and bad for your posture and for your back. If you're more flexible naturally or you really want to get that split going, we can try going into a full split here. As you can tell, mine is not all the way down today. We definitely have some good days and some bad days. Today is not one of those good days. I like to hold this for about 10, 15. If you can get your split all the way down, try to get your hands behind you and lean your back. Ugh. bad leg for stretching and my bad leg for bad anything else. Ooh. I really feel like it might hit me on the ground more than anything because the bruise is. So it's not like switch to me being flat. I have so many flyaways. Like all my hair just like falls out of the ponytail. Like from the front. I have layers but it's not even that. I just have like little wispies everywhere. Oh I just like cramp my foot. You're not being too mobile today. Alright, we're gonna just look left leg is not gonna go. Woo! Yeah, yeah, this one is. I don't know if you guys can tell by my sniffling, but I'm also sick right now. So I usually feel more stiff in my body when I'm sick, which is kind of true right now, so don't ask me why I'm making this video this week when I'm sick. Alright. Woo! Now, I went into butterfly. Hey. I feel like I'm back in it. In gymnastics class like four. Like, we have a flying team today. I just feel like I'm like on FaceTime. I'm new to filming long form videos, you can't tell. And then once you're in it, try to nose to feet, nose to toes. Ah! Are we going into Ninja Stretch? Yeah, we're going into Ninja Stretch. Oh, we're going to Ninja Frog? I don't really know what it's called, but I call it Frog. Oh, my knees are going to be on the hard floor here. Oh, we'll have to deal with it. You go into this position and you try to get your knees as spread apart from each other as possible and your torso as close to the ground as possible. 
Fortunately, I'm supposed to make work. Ooh. My friend Hannah, when I, I was friends with her, she always sits back like this when we do it. I don't know how she does it. Now we're gonna go into middle split. We're doing a sitting straddle. Eh. Arms up, reach to one side. You're pretty ballerina. TikTok sounds so good. It's like, what are we? Which sides? Oof. Into your shell and just slide your legs out as far as they will go. And then once you're there, you're gonna bring your elbows to the ground. And it'll be like this. Ah! It always hurts. One day, I'll be able to do my full split again. All right, we are back to another angle. So, wrist flexors. You're gonna bring the wrist forward. Do it over on. I really hope the frame is low enough, or high enough, you can see my head. And flip the wrist back. Do the same thing, thumbs outward. Make your pinkies touch, if you can. Look at my elbows. I have hyperextension from gymnastics. I too. Hi. And try to lean as forward as you can. I feel like a folding chair. I'm going to stretch those ankles. Hear it popping. And other ankle. Finally, I like to finish it off with a bridge. My knee just cracked so much. Now, the position. And then, right here, your whole body moves. In, and then rock. And once you're flexible enough, you're gonna try to straighten those legs. Ooh, and rock. And we're gonna come down. <sighs> Yay! Have a good workout. I feel like a pretzel. Do I look like a pretzel? <laughs>